Hey everyone, it's Michael from FreshBelief.com and today I'm going to show you how to cut the background out from an image. So let's go in. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is you want to go to the website Pixlr.com. Alright, once you're on the website, log in. Now here you can log in with Facebook or email and your password. If you haven't got a password, uh, or sorry, if you haven't got a, an account, just sign up and log in. It, it's free. I'm just going to log in with Facebook. All right, now I'm logged in. I go down to Pixlr Editor. Uh, create a new image. All right, so now you're at this point. You don't. You want to know what width and what height. So what you do is you go to the image and you right click. You go down to Properties details and it's got the the width and the height so it's 378 by 500 so let's do that 378 500 let's name it weight loss book uh, transparent and okay all right so now we have this we want to get the book So now you can see the book is got a white outline and this is not going to look pretty on a on any website or anything you put on it. So you, what you want to do is you want to actually get rid of this white background. So what you do is you click on here, you click Control A and it will highlight it all. You want to press Control X which will cut the image. Click on here and press Control V and it will paste it on there. Okay, we can get rid of this. No. Nope. Right, so we want to get rid of this so we go to this tool it's called the magic wand and we click here okay so as you can see some of this area has been highlighted also you don't want to delete this area so first thing we're going to do is we're going to go yeah it's, you press control and you click on that area oh sorry shift sorry shift and you click on this area what this will do is it will allow this area to be added to the overall area and then you could just click 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 and click now with some images you've got to get really zoomed in but what we're going to do first is click on this one here now, as you can see this is not very big so I could do this and it's going to take forever okay we're going to go here and we're just going to make it bigger now you can see it's a lot bigger it's a lot easier just to get rid of that uh, the, the outline okay so don't go all the way up. As you can see, some this is just one example, but as you can see, if I click here, it's going to get rid of that. You can see that. If that happens, press Control Z and it will undo. Okay. So just do what you can. That is clearly easily around the book, and then I'll show on to the next stage. Okay. Now to zoom in with this uh, software, on the top of your mouse, roll backwards. Okay. Another thing you can do, you go up to view and zoom in. Okay, so now we're zoomed in. You see this? This will move around so you can get in close. So there's a piece of mist. Look at this. Let's see, what else can I get? Okay, so I want to make this brush smaller uh, smaller now. So I'm going to go 50, down to 50. Yeah, that's okay. Now just be careful. Go around here. There we go. Let's take it off. Oh. So we're going up. Now this here, yeah, you're going to need a slightly smaller brush. Let's go down to 30, see how that is. There we go. And we just hold and drag it along. Now also if you want to zoom, you can hold this icon here and move in. So it allow you to go smaller and smaller and give you more accuracy. Now, if you make a mistake, 
This part here allows you to re-bring up the area that you've made a mistake on. You see what's happening there in this area? Watch this area. You see it's coming back? But what I want to do is I want to get rid of it all. So I just do that. That's if you make a mistake on that. All right, so the last part we want to get rid of is there. So take up that. Um, we want to go back up to the magic wand. Shift. Okay, there we go. Just try and do the best job you can. Okay, that looks good. You go back to this tool here. Remember, people can't see right in, so if you go over a little bit like that, it doesn't really matter. Okay, now click on this tool, which is the marquee tool, which basically does this. And just click outside of the area, and it won't highlight it. So you're not worried about, you basically you have freestyle goings on it now. There you go. Let's Zoom out, let's have a look. Have a look. Yeah, and that looks good. Okay, what you want to do now once this is done, you press file and we go save. And we're gonna go for my way lost book. Okay, change this to a PNG. If you save it as a JPEG, it this this out part will, will stay white. And as you can see, I've done an amateur mistake, and let's just get rid of that. <laughs> Make sure you, you clear it all too guys or well, you're just gonna have a white section in the middle of like if you're doing a squeeze page You can have a white section. So again file save Okay PNG Okay And weight loss book Sorry about that. I've got my head in the way uh, save and there we go, it's done. So yeah, that is how you take the background of your image, whatever image you've got, uh, for free. All right, thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, uh, give me the thumbs up. Uh, if you think this will help somebody, share it with them. If you have any questions, please comment below and I will answer as quickly as possible. Um, that's all for now. I'll share you guys.